Hello everyone, I am Nehal from WS Cube Tech and I welcome you all on the video lecture on the topic of the introduction to the Seaborn library. So Seaborn is nothing but it is one of the amazing data visualization library and it is just simply used in order to just plot the statistical data in Python. So now the reason why I call it as the amazing library over here is that because it includes and give you the variety of default styles or you can just call it as themes or the color palettes and all over here that simply makes your data look more attractive and not only to this not only about uh, uh, the data looking attractive and all it even gives you the power to just visualize your data in a bit depth all right so uh, the thing over here is that you can just consider this uh, seaborn as the advanced data visualization library all right and what makes it different uh, from matplotlib is that uh, you can just plot your statistical data uh, by using this uh, seaborn library in just few lines of code okay so the thing over here is that you don't uh, require much coding over here is that you just a few in just few lines of code you can just uh, come up with your plots and it will just help you with all this uh, stuffs of uh, data visualization of plotting of data and all all right and uh, you can just see this uh, the seaborn's official website it itself states this statement over here is that if matplotlib tries to make easy things easy and hard things possible seaborn here tries to make a well defined set of hard things easy too so you can just see this that by this statement that is quite so powerful statement out there so that can just drive anybody out there to just uh, uh, drive into this library and just explore this a lot all right and i'm just going to take you guys along with me and we are going to definitely explore the seaborn library in depth okay in our further coming tutorial but uh, before do that let's just see that how can you just simply install this particular library that is seaborn over here all right so you can just install this via pip or conda okay and just head over to your terminal or the command line and simply just write this command so if you are having this in uh, pip okay so pip is nothing but our package manager over here you can simply write there pip install and the name of the library that is our seaborn over here and uh, for the next over here for the anaconda distribution over here you can simply just type over your command line or the terminal over here that conda uh, and install and the name of the library that is seaborn over here and this will just in, uh, install all the packages and all required in order to just install this particular library seaborn and one more thing over here is that just make sure that we have already covered the, uh, the topics like numpy pandas and matplotlib so just make sure that you have installed all of this library uh, onto your system over here and in the next video we are going to simply just jump over our jupyter notebook and we'll just start with the practical implementation over there so see you over there